Hey guys, welcome back to World Mechanics. In today's video guys, we're going to show you how to test a camshaft position sensor on BMW, you guys. Uh, this one should cover many BMW models and generations, not just... Uh, uh, we're demonstrating on 3 series from 2006 to 2013, but I've done the same procedure on a 98 to 2005 Beamers and uh, most of them will be that way, guys. So. Stay with us and we'll show you how to test your camshaft position sensor and you will know if it's bad or it needs to be replaced so you don't waste money because those things could be very expensive. Uh, you have two of them on most of the times, on, depending on the model, on the intake right here and the exhaust camshaft. Also guys, just a quick, quick detail, please check out our new channel Electrical Car Repair Life, please subscribe, we'll have more electrical videos there. Uh, engine codes, engine light codes, airbag codes, things like that. So, how you test that now? You don't need to take everything apart. All you have to do, uh, you pull the sensor out of there. And let me show you now. Uh, you have to be very careful not to have your fingers there. Stay out of the way. Okay, we will need to have the ignition on, but do not start the car. You can see the ignition is on. Okay but do not start the car, stay away from the belt and all that stuff. Now we need the voltmeter and the voltmeter guys, okay right here we have the voltmeter and okay let me just leave it right here so okay I'll try to find a place for it okay after that okay you have to connect the negative LED okay to ground on the on the car you can see this is the ground right here now the camshaft sensor guys okay it has three numbers right here for the wires one two and three you will need to okay what we did we peeled number number one uh, there is a special tool that you can clip so you don't have to cut your wire open okay so don't do what, what we do but now I'm going to show you now if you have the ignition on you have the black LED from the voltmeter on negative, the red on number one, okay, and if you do not have tools, okay, or anything like that, okay, you will have, okay, you're going to have five, five volts, okay, when you get a metal tool close to the sensor, okay, a wrench or something, you're going to have zero volts, then you know it works, if it's away, five volts, close to it, zero volts. That's what happens with the camshaft uh, as well. The camshaft has a special spot that the magnet detects, okay? And it shows zero, five, okay? When you're far away from it, where we lost connection, right here. Ah, uh, okay, let me, let's get it quick because we lost the wire, but that's how you test it, guys. If you get a metal object close to it and you have five, uh, zero volts, it's great. If it's far away and you have 5 volts, that's how it should be. Okay, you can see just like that. And you know that the sensor works. If it doesn't work, it's not going to change. So thank you for watching and see you guys next time.